Alright, let's go. Let's go, okay. So now we're off to the Shiver City. However, shall we get there? Oh, according to the wizard man. It is to the sewers we must go. And somewhere deep below. To somewhere deep below Toad Town. Deep in Toad Tunnels. So that is where we will go. And watch out for rogue Koopas. Ow. So that doesn't happen. Okay. Happy. Alright, Cooper. And a power shell to you. And I got the Buzzy Beetle. Sounds heavenly. I get chills whenever I hear these bells. I, I just, it's just something I can't get enough of. And the super block. Who do I want to upgrade though? I'm gonna go with Watt or Wet. I she should have been ultra ranked a little while ago. I mean, after all, she is able to penetrate defense power. Chapter 7, A Star Spirit on Ice. Wow, I think this must be Shiver City alright. It's very pretty. I like it. Check out these homes. These are nice homes, and you can climb up here, and jump across here, and then get yourself a neat little badge in this treasure chest, if I recall correctly. Yes, attack FXE, which, uh, it sounds like a Yoshi, like, paper, you know, that sound Yoshi would make, but really I prefer this. Attack FXA. My favorite. Nice town. Hi. People who travel here to other towns must think that this city is freezing cold. I'm used to it. I'm per I heard, though, that somewhere in the world is a hot town covered in sand. Now that would be intolerable. I don't believe it even exists. Uh, uh, whiz! It's everyone's favorite quiz master, Chuck Quizmo! Hi! Then let's go to the question. What ability does Gloombrio frequently use? That would be Tattle. Hey, I didn't know Luigi was in the audience. Look, he's right over here. I never noticed that. And there's Yoshi, too. Three questions. Hmm. I'm not, I'm not very far with that. Pinky, 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 pop. Feel the rhythm. Stop the pop. To the pinky, pinky, pop. All the snowmen in the line. But the cat fits super fine. Eyes and noses looking cool. Bring a star <laughs> Oh, look at this. He's leaving footprints. Hello, Mr. Penguin. I like your nose. A nice big door. Oh, we have a guest. Welcome, you poor man. You must be freezing. If you'd like to see my husband, he's in the other room. Please, go right in. That's a nice bookshelf and a nice looking snack there. 
nice furniture too. Whoa, that doesn't look good. No reply. Mayor Penguin's body doesn't budge an inch. What's this? He has a memo in his hand that says Herringway. Darling, would you like a cup of tea? Mm -hmm. Oh, dear, you know you'll catch a cold if you sleep there. No! Help, somebody, anybody, my husband is dead, he's been murdered! It's a penguin murder mystery! Ah. Oh no. What's going on here, madam? Just calm down now. You need to speak slowly so I can get to the bottom of this. My husband is dead. Look at him lying there. Oh, my darling husband. Somebody clipped his flippers! By Puffin, you're right. The mayor's been murdered. This is like a mystery novel, except it's real. How tragic. But madam, if I may ask, what on earth would have reason to put this... Or who on reason would... Him, right there. That man with the suspicious mustache. With him? I told him not to come in to the house, but he barged right in. My husband was alive right until this man showed up. He must be the murderer. Hey, you, mustache, are you listening? This good woman's accusing you. What do you say for yourself? Don't try to play ignorant with me, buddy. I'm a professional. We've got a witness here. Isn't that right, madam? Yes, that's right, he did it in cold blood. I, uh, saw it with my own eyes. Yes, besides, he's the only one who came into this room. It all adds up. So you're sticking to your story, claiming you're not the culprit. Mario, um, didn't do it. It's mean that you're treating him like he's a bad guy, even if there's no, um, evidence. Hmm, if you're telling the truth, then we're dealing with a backroom murder case. Oh, I never trained for this. Backroom murder case, a high-ranking penguin slave. How could such a horrible plot twist hit our peaceful city? You, Mr. Mustache, once more for the record, you swear you didn't do this? Okay, I think I believe you, but that means we have to find the true murderer. Ah, perfect. I'll give you a chance. Since you claim that you're not the guilty party, then you must bring me the murderer yourself. If you do that, I'll believe you. It's the only way. Alright, off with you. You haven't proved that you're innocent yet, so I must forbid you to leave the city. Well, excuse me, I thought everyone was innocent until proven guilty, not the other way around. And what's with the memo that says Herringway? That must be really important. It's kind of scary, too. This is a peaceful looking city. I don't see why that would happen. This is a big house, and there's no one here. Locked. This building's a warehouse. Nobody can get in because some careless guard managed to lose the key to the door. I can't believe I lost it. I ought to retrace my steps. Hey, listen, if you find a key anywhere, let me know, okay? Well, I guess that's the order. Hi. I said... I don't talk to penguin killers. Oh, excuse me. I don't know why you're gonna think I did it. Hey, there's a key here. Well, maybe if I break the ice, I can get the key. Great, the ice exploded. Well, now I can swim here and grab the key. Ooh, that's cold. That's cold, that's cold, that's cold, that's cold. Ah, that's cold. Well, Mr. Penguin, I have your key. The building's a warehouse, so... Oh. Thanks for finding that key. I would have been in deep trouble if I couldn't get inside. Well, maybe there's clues in the warehouse. I don't know. Hmm. Just some books, some crates, another crate, and crates atop, um, a cabinet which doesn't have anything inside. And a spring going up here. I don't know, now I'm on the roof and uh oh, whoops. Whoa. Hmm. 
I don't see anything up here except this chimney. Maybe there's something in the chimney. Maybe we have clues inside this home, house, thing, beyond the chimney. Who knows? Soon we will see.